In this video, we will show you instructions on how to register to read accounts in bank with Twitter Creator software. This is the interface of Twitter Creator. First, you will import data. Click on this icon data. This is the database manager's dialog box. There are two ways for you to import data. The first one is to do it manually. Click on this icon, select add group and you enter the group name here. Then click OK. Then select this group. You click on this icon, Add Item. The software will enter the username and password of Twitter accounts after it creates a Twitter account successfully. So you just put these two fields. Then move to the email and password and recovery mail. Then click OK. You can see the data was was imported here. Similarly, you can add thousands of accounts here. And the second way is you will create a Excel sheet here, which have parameters which is corresponding with has in the database manager here. And you can see the username of Twitter accounts column, Twitter password column, and then proxy, part, proxy username, proxy password, email password, and recovery mail column here. Then you click on File, click on Download, select a CSV format. Then click download. Then you open the database manager here. Click on convert. In per CSV, click on this icon and select the CSV file. Download it. You can see all the parameters were imported here. And you can rename the group for easily remember. Then close the database manager style abroad. And at account session, you will select the group of data that you have just imported. Next is the run. Run is the number of times that you want the software run. You can set it at the default. The software will run continuously until you start it, or you can set any number here. Next is tracks. This is the number of Twitter accounts that you want the software create. At the same time, you can set a number which is compliant with your computer configuration here. Next. You will create a folder, name it as cookie. Then you get the path of this folder to paste into the cookies folder section here. Next is proxy sites. There are three choices for you to choose here. And the first one is from data. That means you will import proxy import and proxy username and password here in database manager. Next is from file. You select from file here. And at file proxy section, there are two options for you to choose. First, you will create a text file to save proxy. For example, these are the proxies that I want to use. You can see the format here is IP part, proxy username and proxy password. You can leave the username password blank if your proxy don't need proxy username and password to run. And I enter these proxies per line. At file proxy, select lines from file and select a file proxy created. The second way is you will select lines from URL. You will paste 
the link address a proxy that you rent from the proxy provider here. Next, add the user agent session. Just uploaded the user agent file that we had provided you. Next, with the first name session, there are two options for you here. The first one is random string and the second one lies from file. With the random string, just click on this icon, then click on edge test. You can see the name that has created automatically here. You can add or delete any parts that you want. Another way is select lines from file. You will create a text file to save name here. For example, these are names that I want to create and then select live from file. Click on this icon, select the text file of name created. You will do similarly with last stream and password. Next, sleep time is time that the software takes break between tracks. So this is the unit here is a millisecond. If you import 10,000, that's mean 10 seconds. Next, with IMAP server and IMAP port, just import the IMAP server and IMAP port here. You can find this IMAP server import in the tutorial and on Google. Then finally, you click OK to run. You can click on Show Browser to see how the software create, creates a Twitter account.
to get results uh, with the account created, you click on this icon. You will see the data here. Click on this, and you will see the Twitter accounts created in this row. These demonstrated above are instructions on how to create Twitter accounts in Bank with Twitter Creator software. You can visit artbossoft.com to see more useful software. Thank you very much for your time. See you in the next video.